everyone, it's Miss Courtney, and today we are going to do some painting using bubbles. So before we start, there's a few things you're going to need. You will need a white piece of paper, some paints, I have blue and green, some dish soap, a cup or two uh, halfway filled with water, and straws. So the first thing that I did is I put um, a blue straw in one cup and a green straw in my other cup because those are the two colors I'm going to be using today. So we have our cups labeled and I'm going to take dish soap and I'm going to add one to two drops of dish soap in each container. One, two, For my blue, I'm going to add, you want to add enough paint that your water is very, very dark. So I would do at least a tablespoon or two. You don't have to measure it out. But what you want to do is that this mixture is going to make our bubbles, and you want to make sure that your bubbles are nice and dark so that they show up on your paint. Just mixing it up a little bit. I have my blue done and now it's time for the green. Okay, and once they're thoroughly mixed, you're going to have your paper ready in your hand and you're going to blow into the straw. Make sure you don't suck it in or you will drink the paint and that won't be good. So you're gonna blow bubbles and then you're gonna tap your paper on top of those bubbles and it will create the bubble painting. So I'm gonna do it really quick. Okay, I tapped a few on there and if your bubbles aren't dark enough, you can always add more paint. some of the old bubbles in here too. And when you have enough bubbles on your paper, you're going to let it dry for a while and then you can hang it up because that's how we do bubble painting. Here's a little bit of a look at mine. I don't know if you guys can see it very well, but I'll give you a flow so um, just in a second. Here is a close-up of my bubble painting. Um, it's very light right now, so I could have added some more paint, but here's some of the green bubbles. And there's still some bubbles on the blue, but there's some of the blue bubbles. So you can always add more paint to make yours darker. Um, otherwise, if you like it light, you can leave it like this as well. I hope you guys enjoyed this lesson of Art Incorporated today, and I hope to see you guys soon.